Oh. Look back of card. Alright. So, Hertz Renabike. Uh, alright. I know where that is. Hertz Renabike is page 24. Okay, so we got 24. Uh, Bippy's Island Liquors. I remember seeing that. I just, I'm just thinking like, wait, did they actually give me like a fake password? <laughs> uh. Alright, where is Bippy's? Hmm. Burlesque. Bippy's Island Liquors. That is page 10. 24, 10. <laughs> And the last one is Fat City. Okay, that one should be in here and should be easy to find. Hmm. <clears throat> hmm. I'm not seeing one for Fat City either. Okay, here we go, here we go. Fat City. Alright, that one is page 23, so 24, 10, 23 is the combo. Alright, man. <clears throat> Just the damn is all I can say. They, they gave me a fake password. So let me go ahead and save here because, yeah, that's... This is a password that works, alright? <clears throat> Open door. I, I just still can't believe they gave me a fake password. <laughs> like, they gave me a, a, a like a... Because you're supposed to look up all the advertisements in the manual, and there just wasn't one for that. There, That one didn't exist in the manual. At least not the copy of the manual that I have. Alright, maybe it's missing a page, I don't know. Like, it very well could be missing a page. But, yeah, hmm. Alright. Open locker. Okay, 24, 10, 23. Okay. Look inside. Look locker. Look in locker. Alright, alright, so sweats. So, put on sweats. Yeah, we gotta do all this again. Um, so now, put clothes in locker. Not yours to drop. Uh, put towel in locker. Um, clothes locker. There we go. Hmm. <laughs> And yeah, input, um, <clears throat> I, I forgot to announce, I, I think I forgot to announce that I was streaming today. But also, also, I'm just like, I'm a little under the weather today. I'm a little under the weather, I think probably just because I, irregular sleep schedule doesn't help. <clears throat> so that's why I'm all, all nasaled, uh, and no one likes that. Alright, no one likes nasally streamer, oh no. But I'm hoping it'll clear up after a while. It usually takes me like a good two hours to properly wake up, so I'm hoping two hours in, I'll I'll be back to my normal self. <laughs> all right, so let's do all of our exercises again, again. All right, all right, time to pump that iron. All right, I had to do eleven pumps last time, and apparently the number is variable. Uh, apparently the number is completely variable, and sometimes you'll have to do a lot more than other times. Okay, good, it's it's 11 again. All right. Use. Use. You've bench pressed a ton already. Ah, uh, oh, I see. I see. So, yeah, let's let's do our all our exercises. Mm. No, I didn't, uh, this game is actually a little, uh, <clears throat> it's a little bit more convoluted. 
And this game is actually a little bit more convoluted than Leisure Suit Larry uh, 1 or 2. So it's gonna take me a little bit longer. Like, the, I have the walkthrough, and the walkthrough doesn't tell you everything. Like, the, the walkthrough does not tell you everything. Like, it didn't... It... I... <laughs> Like, it, it didn't really make it clear that you had to, like, close the locker, right? Or you get, or you you just, you're, you're just done, you know? It, there's a lot of things this walkthrough leaves out, but it's the official walkthrough. It's the official Sierra help document. Alright, exercises. Mm. Also, this, it's got mini games. Mm. There we go. Stop, and there's one more, one more. Alright, supposed to be fun. If I'm at, are we having fun yet? I don't know. <laughs> alright, alright, pump that iron, pump that iron. Mmm. Okay, we done we done it. We done it. And yeah, and then all the exercise it immediately pays off as we grow to grotesque proportions. Yeah. Mmm. Feel pumped. Rocky theme. Those those pectorals. They are in fact pulsating. Yeah, 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 Larry likes it, but nothing lasts forever, and yeah, those, those muscles, yeah, he can win contests. Mmm, body by steroids. And then it springs a leak. <coughs> yeah, yeah. Which all I can think of is, um, you know, when I think of a, like, is muscle sprung a leak? You know, that is a thing, like, people in, like, it, it, apparently it's, it's quite a thing, and apparently it's more popular, you know, in, in, uh, in South America, but, like, there's, you know, the, the injecting, like, like, in, injecting weird, like, uh, you know, oils and stuff into your muscles and just to make them look bigger. You know, it's like, it, it, it's like, uh, it, it, it's kind of like the male equivalent of a boob job, except, you know, you're just injecting, like, weird, uh, fluids into your muscles to make them bulge out and look big, and people look so weird when they, when they do that. Like, it doesn't, like, it doesn't look like muscle, it just looks like they've got Popeye arms, you know? And then, and also, it's like, it's really prone to getting infected and leaking. Leaking! Oh, oh, it's horrible, horrible. Anyway, uh, let's open locker. <clears throat> Alright, so, 24, 10, 23. Okay, take off sweats. Alright, look in locker. Okay, yeah, my leisure suit is still in there. Alright. <clears throat> Put on towel. There we go. <clears throat> hmm. You carefully tie the beach towel around your waist, leaving your leisure suit in the locker with the sweatsuit. Alright, close locker. <clears throat> there we go. I still have my inventory on me. Yeah. Uh, okay, okay. Hmm. <laughs> uh. And and yeah, yeah, it's not it's it's not it like there's just there's issues. There's issues. <laughs> but it's just it's I don't know, like people that it, it makes you look really really weird. Like like not muscular, just weird. Anyway, you hang your towel just outside the shower room, where you'll be able to reach it easily upon exit. Although then again, like like I still say, it's it's like 
it's like the male equivalent of the boob job, you know? It's like, cause it doesn't, it doesn't look natural, it doesn't look right, but apparently a lot of people like it. I don't know. So let's use shower. Alright. Use soap. There we go, there we go. We're all, all nice and clean, all nice and clean. Uh, turn off. Turn off shower. There we go. <clears throat> so yeah, we took a nice little, you know, two second shower. Alright. And also, today I got, like, the chat over on the other side of me, just cause, like, I, I got the walkthrough up over here, chat over here. Alright, so that's, that's different direction I'm looking in. <clears throat> Alright, open locker. Oh man, I love how it makes you put your combo in every time. 10, uh, 23. <clears throat> Alright, take off towel. Alright. Use deodorant. There we go. Mm. Use towel. I wonder, can I de deodorant again? Yeah, there we go. Alright, so extra, give me an extra layer of deodorant. <laughs> Alright, so I've used, uh... Hmm. Okay, so I've, I've dried off, I've used the deodorant, I think I'm good. Uh, put on suit. Alright. I'm ready to face the world of women. Alright, close locker. So, I, I guess we're doing this all just to get laid again, right? I mean, I, I, I guess that's why Le Leisure Suit Larry is doing all this. Uh, we're, we're fresh now. Alright. I like how saving the game kills the music. Yeah, yeah. All right, so let's let's get out of the locker room. Hmm. I mean, here's the thing. Like, I, I kind of wonder what is Larry even doing here, and I, I guess Larry is here to get laid again because I suppose, I, I suppose hitting the gym is a good way to get laid. I guess. I I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> So, let's save, save game, alright, open door, let's look around, <clears throat> yeah, all doors open to me, what is all this now, hmm, huh, look, you are in Fat City's aerobic studio, which is presently filled with audio video equipment, looks like someone was recently here making a video. Huh, am, am I supposed to be here? Um, <laughs> hmm. Okay, I think I think maybe I'm not supposed to have the clothes on actually. I I, I think the the guide's a little um it's, it's a little suspect on these things, but I I think I'm not supposed to have the clothes. Um Okay, so let's open the door. Well, like, look, it's Leisure Suit Larry, alright? You gotta cheat. 
I've already gotten into a- see, this game has fail states, alright? I've already hit one fail state today, so... Yeah, I, I'm trying to avoid fail states, you know, because you know what ain't great? Go, getting like hours into the game and then realizing that something you did hours ago put you in a fail state, you know, where you cannot progress. Yeah, so Sierra Adventure Games, open locker. All right, combo is 24, 10, 23. All right, put on towel. So I'm pretty sure, okay, the, okay, let's, let's close locker. <clears throat> so yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure that, uh, <clears throat> yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure that the, the guide didn't say anything about putting your clothing back on. So I, I think we're supposed to be walking around with a towel on. <clears throat> I mean, maybe because that, like, you know, that highlights our pectorals, right? You know, ladies love bulging, veiny muscles. They they sure love that. All right. You know, really, you know, get gets their imagination working. Uh, I guess. <laughs> Wait, hey, take off that towel and put on your leisure suit if you want to visit the lobby. Oh. Hmm. Okay. So apparently, I. Hmm. Okay. Well, hold on, hold on. Restore game. So there's an issue here. The issue is, is that there's supposed to be somebody to talk to in, in here. Hmm. Well, let me try opening some more doors. Open door. Can't go in there. The tanning booth is out of order. We'll get it fixed real soon. Hmm. Yeah, so, so there's supposed to be somebody to talk to in the northern room. Um, talk to men. Hello, says Robin. New in town? Hmm. Uh. Huh. Oh, it doesn't, doesn't matter. Alright. Talk to Robin. You certainly have an interesting way with clothes, insults the man behind the counter. Uh, okay, let me let me just look at the guide again and see what am, what am I missing? Hmm. All right, I put on the towel. I close the locker. I entered, so I close the locker and enter left door. Walk to the top screen. Turn on shower. Use soap. Turn off shower. Return to locker. Open it. Dry off. Use deodorant. Leave locker room. Open door to north room. Talk to girls several times. Okay, so, so there should be a girl in here. <clears throat> Open door. And there is no girl in here. Like, talk girl. Hello, you say. There's no, yeah, there's no one here. So what am I doing? Hmm. Oh wait, look, jeez, it's dark back here, you cry, ramming your nose into the rear wall of the studio. Ow. Hmm. Hmm. Like, have I missed something? Have I... Have I somehow... Have I somehow missed something? I don't... Hmm. <clears throat> I wonder if I was too slow. Like, what, was I too slow? Oh my god. Was I too slow and I'm just in a fail state right now? Am I in a... Am I a walking dead right now? Like, did I lose the game like five hours ago and I just didn't know it? Oh my god. Uh, look. Hmm. Someone was recently here making a vi... So someone was recently here making a vi Oh my god, we missed it, didn't we? Uh, we... Let me, let me go to the Google machine real quick, and let me see if I've missed it somehow. Okay. Leisure Suit Larry 3. Fat City. <clears throat> hmm. Alright, let me, let me see what I missed out on here. Uh, so I gotta find, I don't know, like, Game Facts, help me. Game, Game Facts, help me. <laughs> alright, so let me take a look. I, I need to know if I missed something, alright? Hmm. Alright, so we've entered the fat city, the doors will open, use 
Okay, I looked at that. I wear sweats, clothes, locker. I use the machine. Hmm. Wait, what's this now? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, man, I... Like, if this is time-sensitive, oh god. <clears throat> So I'm looking to see what I missed here. Hmm. Like Bambi's not so 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 a girl named Bambi is supposed to be there, <clears throat> and she's not. All right. <clears throat> hmm. Like Bambi's supposed to be there. No no, no Bambi. Like. What, what did I do wrong? <laughs> hmm. Oh god, like, what what did I do wrong? Uh, I, I can't really seem to find anything. <clears throat> yeah, I, I, I can't seem to find anything that implies anything, so... Maybe I have to leave and come back? I don't know. But I, I have a I have a really sickening feeling that this was a time sensitive event. And that I've missed it somehow. I, I got a sickening feeling. Hmm. <clears throat> Look door. There's aerobic studio. Use card. Yeah, yeah, there's no there's no Bambi here, so I've missed something. Hmm. Huh. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, interesting input. I. Again, I have to go back to XCOM at some point. The the uh, try that open XCOM out. But but okay, like I can't I can't find anything. I I need help. I need help. Um, cause I'm googling it now. How okay? So so Bambi is not in Fat City. Is this a time sensitive event? Have I missed it, or have I not done something? I I'm not sure. Um. Aerobic studio, there's no Bambi. Hmm. I, I'm looking like I'm looking at every walkthrough I can right now to see what I've done wrong exactly. Hmm. So I'm I, like I just figure maybe maybe one of these guides left something out, you know? Maybe they they forgot to mention a critical step or something. Hmm. Now there is one thing I forgot to do, which was I forgot to uh, to wear the showgirl outfit like ages ago. I forgot to wear the showgirl outfit to the to the lawyer, but I I don't see like everything proceeded as normal, so I don't see how I could have missed something. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, wait, wait. Maybe I maybe I haven't missed anything. Okay, it says to look at stage. That's something that the other the official Sierra guide did not mention that. So open door, and maybe maybe I, there's something I can't see. Look stage. It's just as it appears. Uh, hmm. Okay. So it says, okay, let me see if there's anything I might have missed, all right? Hmm. Hmm. Okay, so let me see if I missed something here. So, okay, go to Locker, six, locker 69. We did that. Uh, go to Exercise Room. All right, yeah, go back to Equipment Room. Use Curl, walk to front. I, I did all the exercises. Alright, open locker, remove sweats, close locker. Yeah, we did the 
Wait. Wait. Walk to center of shower. Use soap. Rinse. I didn't rinse. Hmm. Okay. Huh. Huh. Like, and there's no girl here, right? Yeah, okay, so... So, let's try something here. So, back to... I don't know, getting locker, fat city. Uh, hmm. Getting locker? Uh, where am I at now? I, I guess I've, uh... I, I guess I've done the things I needed to do. I guess I... Uh, unclear as to where I'm at exactly here. But... Open locker. 24-10-23. Oh god, this is the fail state. We're in the fail state, aren't we? We're in the fail state. Oh god. So wait. So it's not that one. It's not this one. Uh, I guess Fat City? I, I guess... Oh, god damn, I'm gonna have to do all this... Hmm. No, no, um, what you're... So, like, okay, here's... What it seems like is supposed to happen is you're supposed to go in the aerobics room and there's a girl on stage filming a video. Uh, that's, that's like, that's what you're... That's what's supposed to be happening. Um, which, let me go ahead and open, like, like, what if I open the door right now? Open door. Because I have a feeling, like, okay, see, look, this is what's supposed to be happening in here. This is what's supposed to be happening. So, look, girl. Hello, beautiful, you say. My name is Larry. Larry Laffer. Nice to meet you, Larry Laffer. From the looks of that stomach, you've come to the right place. So, I mean, like, this this is what was supposed to have happened, but but after I did all the aerobics. Oh. Okay. So yeah, this is Bambi. All right, n n another another EGA girl we can fuck. All right. So, look. You feel certain you could learn to fawn over Bambi? Mm. Uh, talk to Bambi. Hello, beautiful. My name's Larry. Larry Laffer. My, my, your body is certainly ready for one of my workouts. Oh, my. Okay, let's... Let's work out... On my di... On my di... No, no, no. <laughs> um... Ask about workout. What in the hell are you talking... Okay, um... Well, let's see. M maybe the guide, like... Maybe it put it in the wrong order. Yeah, is this sex? I don't know. Um, so, like, maybe they put it in the wrong order. I don't know. But, okay, I'm at Bambi, so I, I just have to keep talking to her. Talk. Just say what you wish. Talk to Bambi. Yes, we know that. Okay, talk again. It says talk to her several times. Talk Bambi. It, it just says to talk to her several times, and like, well, I'm doing that. <laughs> uh, how about flirt Bambi? She's not interested. Um, hmm. Alright, how about fuck Bambi, why not? You wonder if you are fit enough to handle this one. Oh, I'm not. So I'm not fit enough to handle her. I see, I see. Um, shame on you. Your face is an open book. Huh. I haven't saved in a while, no thanks. Uh, talk Bambi. Okay, so I guess there's nothing else I can talk to her about. Um, hmm. So what does the guide say I should do? I should, uh, hmm. Talk to her several times. 
No, wait, wait, okay, let's see. Talk to girl several times. Help Bambi with video. Okay. Help Bambi with video. Would you like some help with your video project, Bambi? Not from you, Mr. Husky. What could a tubbo like you know about fitness? Uh, see, that's where we gotta do all the workouts. And so I think maybe, just because I didn't rinse, maybe that... I don't know. Yeah, so I'm a tubbo, apparently. Uh, so yeah, yeah, fuck you too, Bambi. <laughs> Stop looking. Can't wait to see you work out again, Bambi. Come back when you feel helpful, Larry. Alright. So yeah, yeah. O okay, so maybe, maybe I missed something and this is what I was supposed to do first. And also, I think that not rinsing, I think that might have uh, fail-stated me as well. So let's save on that city. Open door. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, like just just talk until sex happens. I so so here's the thing. All right, what it there seems to be several fail states in this area. All right, <clears throat> like like if you if you change out of your clothing and you go do all the things and then you know and then you go back to your locker but you didn't close the locker, then you, all your clothing gets stolen and you're in a Walking Dead fail state. You know, you're you can no longer play the game. Um, so apparently if you don't do everything in here exactly the game the way the game wants you to you are in a fail state apparently so all right knowing knowing that knowing that open locker 24 10 23 okay so uh, first things first put on sweats All right. Okay, close locker. Close locker. There we go. All right, so yeah, apparently we just have to do everything perfectly, okay? So I guess I guess I used soap, right? Like it, like so when I was in the when I was on the shower step, I I used soap, but I didn't actually shower. So like I I guess that that kind of boned me on that one. Okay, so now we have to exercise. Again. Again. Mm. <laughs> what? You don't like what? What? Y your local gym doesn't have just a labyrinthian maze of lockers complete with a minotaur? What? Your your gym's doing it wrong, input. <laughs> All right. Congratulations, you've done 11 leg curls. But I can do more if I want to, right? Hmm. Like, it'll let me do more. I mean, maybe I should, maybe I should do more. Hmm. I don't know. I, I don't know. I think that's enough, so stop. All right, use. Okay, gotta, gotta pump up again. Uh. <laughs> oh man, no, no Minotaur. Mm. Kind of. Do you even Minotaur, bro? <laughs> okay, I, I pumped my iron again, so let's let's go to the next one. Okay, use. Alright, we're we're doing we're doing ex we're doing exercise. Again. Third time. Third time's a charm, right? <laughs> this time, let's make another save file, okay? Like I feel like this time I should definitely make a separate save file just like midway through these steps. Just in case. Just in case. Okay, stop. And final one. Use. <clears throat> I like how every one of these is animated nice and good. Mm. 
All right, all right. Mm. Pumping up, pumping up, and then we get to then we get the body by steroids again after this. Mm. Okay, so stop. Oh boy, exercise! I'm a new man. Yeah, yeah. Deformity. Mmm. Oh man, again. So I'm just gonna, gonna tab through this. Hmm. Yeah, pulsating, pulsating. Which again, that is what that is what women like. All right. It's you. You need that. You know that that Conan esque body. All right. That that says, "Baby, I could lift you up your you know off your feet and and just ravage you at a moment's notice." You know, hopefully consensually, hopefully. All right. <laughs> all right, there we go. So we're we're all pumped up, all pumped up. <laughs> all right. So now now let's make another save file. All right, save game. So save on uh getting locker. There we go. So now, so now I have a little save file after I've done the workouts, but before I've changed out of the clothing. So, so if we if we mess it up again, we can go back to that. All right, open locker. <clears throat> All right, twenty-four, ten, twenty-three. <clears throat> okay, uh, put on towel. <coughs> All right, close locker. <clears throat> I like how, you know, if we if we botch any of these steps, we're just fail stated. Mm. Mm. All right, we hang up our towel and we get a you know, we get a nice undershot here. So, turn on shower. Okay. Use soap. All right. Rinse. You rinse your body in the sensually warm running water. Uh, rinse again. All right, so... So let me make sure I'm doing everything I need to do in the shower. <clears throat> I think I'm doing everything. Hmm. All right, I hope I'm doing everything. Turn off. Turn off shower. There we go. <clears throat> okay, got my towel. So yeah, we we rinsed up. Like we didn't we didn't just use the. You know, we didn't just use soap and call it a day. We we actually took a proper shower that time. All right. Open locker. All right. 24, 10, 23. All right. Uh, so now, okay, now specifically, I dry off. All right, so we're dry. I, th I think last time I used the deodorant and then I dried off too. So, okay, we dried off. Now let's use the deodorant. Okay, okay. All right. Let's save again because I've done everything right. Done everything right. Um, let me... Oh, uh, it kills the sound. So let me just make sure real quick that I um I'm on a right path here. So okay, I've done the locker thing. I've uh, used soap. I've rinsed. Turned off of water. Uh, okay. Use deodorant. Gets okay. 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 We're we're on a right path here. Mhm. Mm all right. All right. So now we uh yeah we get suit. <clears throat> Okay, ready to face the world of women, close locker, alright, 
So now, now we should be okay to to do the video with Bambi. All right, like we we should be okay to do that video with Bambi, and Bambi should still be there. Like she should still be there. Um, there shouldn't be any reason why she isn't. Hmm. Like Bambi even said, "Come back when you feel useful," and well, we're useful now, right? <laughs> Okay, save game, save game. So, so we are we are fresh now. All right, we are fresh now. So I'm I'm ready to help out Bambi. Okay, open door. And we only get sound when I type. There. Okay, there we go. There we go. There we go. So. Yeah, let's talk, girl. Perhaps you should look look girl yeah hi Bambi how's it going here we go all right so talk talk Bambi why all the elaborate video equipment for a simple aerobics class <clears throat> so does she want to talk now oh that's not for my class I'm working on a new videotape for worldwide distribution oh see look now so now that we're all buff macho man like now she wants to actually talk to us all right yeah see she doesn't she doesn't call us tubbo now hmm all right talk again so how's it going oh man not well, with so many workout tapes in today's marketplace, I'm having trouble coming up with a certain little something that will make mine different, establishing my competitive edge. So she's looking for a new kind of workout. Um, and let me guess, the new workout is like, and then we just fuck on stage, right? Is, is, that, is that it? I, I think you might be in the wrong video industry, Bambi. Okay, talk Bambi. Say, I used to be in marketing. Perhaps I could help you. We, we did? Like, like, wait, was Larry in marketing? Gosh, Larry, that would be wonderful. If you could, I'd be eternally grateful. Hmm, eternally grateful, you say. O okay, okay, so now we need to, uh... Offer to help with video. It's not your... Help Bambi with video. Bambi, I've got it! I know just the angle that will sell that video of yours! Alright, what what does Larry got? Sex! Oh boy, sex! Oh, oh my god! Leisure Suit Larry! Mmm. Oh man. Glass is already fogging up, so... So apparently sex is the thing that'll help her to sell aerobics videos, so uh... Sure, why not? Why not? Sexual aerobics, let's do it. Of course! Why didn't I think of that? If sex sells toothpaste, it surely should sell aerobics! Alright, um... Well, we'll be the first aerobics video to use sexual positions for our exercises! Can you do it, Bambi? Can you make it interesting? <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. Leisure... Leisure Suit Larry. I, I really hope Dunna's not looking right now because we're about to we're about to do a lot of disappointment right here. <laughs> Interesting, I should say. Watch this. Alright. Tell me what you think of these moves, Larry, Bambi says. Oh yeah, look at them gams. Look at them gams. Uh, alright. Ooh, alright. Splits. Splits. Hmm. It needs to be a little hotter, Bambi, you say. Come on. How about this? Oh, oh my god, she's just twerking! She's just twerking! 1980s twerking! Yes, yes! <laughs> You're getting there. Shake to- oh my, oh my god, she's just doing stripper moves now. Make it rain! Shake that ass! Here's a little move that puts us over the top, Bambi yells. Now she's just doggy style twerking. I, I what is happening, right? I love it. <laughs> oh no, Dunn is disappointed. Uh-oh. 
I can't stand this any longer. Larry, all these movements, come on! It's enough rehearsal, it's showtime! All right. Oh, Larry, I'm so excited about this. So yeah, I guess she she couldn't handle all that rehearsal. It's time to get it on. Let's let's get it on. Oh yeah. I I mm, sleaze sleaze. Oh look, new video ideas. Okay, let's do it. Also, Bambi is stacked on you know, Look at that. Damn. Come on, Larry, says Bambi. Let's do a little blocking. All right. Oh, we're going into the employees only room. Oh, uh, oh, wait. Wait, what? This is the tan This is a tanning bed. Um Here's a nice quiet spot where I'm sure we won't be disturbed. This old tanning machine has been broken since like the late 80s. Oh, yeah. I think this game is um I, I think this game is early 90s. So it's not it's not 80s twerking. 90s twerking. <laughs> You know, or just shaking your ass, as we used to say. So, she asks, Why don't you step over here to my casting couch, and I'll audition you for a role in my new video. Oh my. Leisure Suit Larry's getting the ca- <laughs> He's getting the casting couch. Alright. Perhaps a role would be more like it. <laughs> Bambi, I may not be able to keep up with you aerobically, but remember, practice makes perfect. Uh, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh god damn, don't even take your pants off, Larry. Just, just do it, get in there, get on it. <laughs> bamf, bamf, bamf. <laughs> uh, you know, Larry, no pain, no gain. That's right, let's make it hurt real good. Wait, what? <laughs> Um, alright. Your energetic pre-aerobic warm-up loosens the stuck lid of the defective tanning machine. <laughs> oh god! Oh god, it hurts! It hurts! Wow, Larry, you're the first man who's ever made me see lights. <laughs> oh god, my balls! So, yeah. That's great. The brilliant glow of 1500 watts of ultraviolet B heats your back so quickly it cramps your style. Hey Bambi, you cry, struggling to raise the lid. How do you get this thing up? Oh, she's getting it up right now. <laughs> That's your problem, Larry. I just like to raise the lid of this tanning booth. <laughs> Larry, help! It's stuck! No, it's not. I'm, I'm just having trouble moving this, this, moving with this lid on my back. Oh, she's talking about the tanning booth, and Larry's talking about his dick. Uh, I love it. I love Leisure Suit Larry. Bambi slips out of the tanning machine, out the door, and out of your life leaving you to ponder yet another of life's great mysteries. Why is it so damn hard to get an even tan in the machine? Mm. Nice. So yeah, we fucked Bambi. Nice, nice. <laughs> Alright, so uh, I, I think we did good. I, th I think we did good. Well, we'll save... Yeah. We got laid! Again! <laughs> Alright, so, uh, that was Fat City, um, I think I did everything, yeah, I've, I've done everything there. So, uh, so now we need to go to the Chippendales, alright? Yeah, we gotta go to the Chippendales now. <laughs> that was, uh, that was interesting. Mm. Alright. You know, there's, there's just something about Leisure Suit Larry's style of humor that I love. It's, it's, it's immature, and yet, it really has a great, you know, it has a great tone to it, in a weird way. I like it. I like it. So I'm not sure which, which way am I supposed to be going here. I, I kind of forget. Um, maybe straight up. No, uh, I'm trying to remember where the Chippendales was, um, Hmm. I 
Like, I know the divorce thing was up in the top right. Hmm. If I, if I just go right... Okay, there we go, there we go. Now we're at the Chippendales. So, okay, the cave. So, so wait, hold on, hold on, we're... Oh, oh god. So the cave, it says enter the cave to the left and save. It says save immediately, so okay, okay. Um, saving immediately. Caves. Um, so I'm supposed to walk towards the edge on the left and get some flowers. Uh, okay, make a lay, ah. So why did it want- wait, hold on, let me guess, there's ways to die in here, right? Yeah, there we go, goddamn Sierra! <laughs> of course, see that- that's why they- okay. Yeah, that's why they said to save your game immediately. Well, Larry, are, are you now fully convinced that gravity really sucks? Hmm. Order a hint book. No, 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 keep on muddling. Um, okay. So yeah, let's get a flower. Alright, get flowers. Move closer to the flowers near the cave opening. They are more beautiful since they catch more light. That's why there's not... Yeah, okay. Get flowers. There we go. So basically, you have to be one pixel away from dying. Alright, you pluck a few flesh orchids from the walls of the crevice. Good, good. So that's all we needed here. All right, make lay. You weave the wild orchids into a beautiful lay. There we go, nice. Welcome to the islands, Mr. Laffer. Mm. Okay, so I got my, I got my flowers. All right, that's good, that's good. So now, hmm. All right, all right, so I did that. So now I need to go to the casino lounge for reasons. For reasons. Hmm. Also, hey there, UL. Hey there. I'm just stumbling around in confusion with Leisure Suit Larry. I, I've already I, I've already hit like five fail states, so I'm <laughs> I'm following the guide real close. <laughs> <clears throat> Alright, so it says we need to go to the casino and we have to go to the lounge. Which is on the- that's on the right side of the casino. Alright. Hmm. Okay, so yeah. Lounge B up here. Like the, uh, nice casino music. Okay, okay, so the last time I went to the lounge, there wasn't anything there. There's something there now. All right, all right, okay, there's, there, there's, there's another possible sex encounter. All right, so let's save this one on casino. Okay, so, uh, hmm. we go to the casino. Okay, so, oh, this is... Oh right, she's playing a piano, uh, cause Patty was in the last game playing a piano. That's That was her cameo. So this is Patty again. Alright. Sit. So yeah, she's passionate Patty. She plays the piano. Quite... precariously? I don't know how many P words. So, alright. Look, girl. Hello, beautiful, you say to the pianist. My name's Larry. Larry Laffer. You know, fresh off getting laid in the tanning booth, we're, we're, we're hunting for some more. Like, man, I feel like, um, the, the goal is the same as always, UL, get laid. And we've already gotten laid, like, two or three times. We got laid, so first off, we got laid, um, I'm trying to think, we, uh, I, I think we, we briefly got laid on the beach, um, and then, and then we, lobsters got in our pants, uh, we, we got we got laid by Cherry Tart in the uh, in the casino, the showgirl. We could have gotten laid at the divorce lawyer. We could have, but we didn't. Um, and we we just had sex in a tanning booth, and then the tanning booth like closed on us and shocked our balls. 
but we've gotten laid like four times th or three times. So we're trying, we're trying for a fourth here. I feel like let's just call this UL's quest, right? This is, this is UL quest here. All right. We, it's like, God damn. It's never, never enough. Never enough. Anyway, anyway, uh, here we go. All right. Hello to you, Larry replies, passionate Patty. I am the girl of your dreams, passionate Patty. Nice. Hey. Ah, <laughs> uh, UL. It's so true, though. It's so true. <laughs> this is UL Quest. UL Quest 3. <laughs> uh, all right. So let's uh, let's have a look. Before you sits the latest girl of your dreams in the world. The, the, oh, the world-famous piano bar entertainer, Passionate Patty. Talk to Patty. Larry, you won't get much out of life if you don't go for it. Well, that's what I'm doing right now. I'm going for it. Um, hmm, let me check. I don't want to mess it up. Uh, huh. Okay. Talk Patty. You know, Larry, I always say, it's not the men in your life that count, it's the life in your men. Hmm. <laughs> uh, let's talk again. Hmm. Larry, I believe in the old saying, a good man is hard to find, but a hard man is, is good to find. Oh uh, yeah, just, mmm, mmm. <laughs> All right. Well, let's talk again. O okay, so that's I think we've hit the end of that one. Hmm. So Oh, okay, so apparently I'm supposed to show Patty the decree the the so Larry Larry got divorced at the beginning of the game cuz his his island his island girl lover um his island girl lover decided to leave him for another woman at the beginning of the game so yeah we got divorced so let's show Patty the decree Patty look I did it my divorce is finalized here take it frame this thing and mount it here on your piano <laughs> nice yeah, zipper. <laughs> oh no, input. Congratulations, Larry. Did I mention earlier how much I love single men? Suddenly, you've become a lot more interesting to me. We should get together sometime. Oh, all right, all right. Hmm. Ooh, right. Give Patty the lay. Patty, please, wear my lay tonight for me alone. Oh, Larry, thank you. You're such a charmer. I'm ready. What do you want to do? All right, ask Patty on a date. There we go. Oh, well, what the hell? It's getting late. I'm ready to quit for the night, and you're looking better all the time. Sure, let's go. Yes, we are in. We are in. Here, Larry, take the key to my suite, says Patty. I'll slip out the back way and use the service elevator. Just wait a few minutes before you come upstairs, as I'd like to slip into something more comfortable. Like your flowers. Nice. Oh, and remember, Larry, I refuse to make love to a man without something to drink first, so so she's got to get liquored up before she can have sex with Larry? That doesn't sound good. Okay, she says over her shoulder. No, no offense, of course. Nice, nice. All right. <laughs> None taken, you suppose. Hmm. All right, stand. So yeah, I, I guess we got to get her some booze because she can't stand to be with Larry without it. Um. So let's see, where do I find booze? Um. Hmm. Okay. So apparently, I'm I'm supposed to go back to the comedy hut. Apparently. All right. You know, the comedy hut where they, they, uh, you know, they have all those fun ethnic jokes. All those fun ethnic jokes. <laughs> and hey there, Zara. Hey there. Hey there. 
We're, we're trying to get laid again. Mm. It's, it's an ongoing quest. Ongoing quest. Yep, yep, the, the quest to get laid, it never ends, Zara. Never. <laughs> uh, okay, okay. Um, so, to get back to the comedy club, I think we just... I... Wait, no, the, the exit is like, it's like over here, right? I think it's over here. There we go. Okay, so comedy club is next to the Chippendales. So... Yeah, let's let's get up here. We're so once we do all the comedy club stuff, I think we'll be we'll be on like the last final stretch of the game, or at least the final stretch of the walkthrough, at least. <laughs> okay, so I need to. There we go. I need to get to the chip and it's right next to the Chippendales. And Larry, walk faster. Uh... I'm surprised there's no, like, you know, and then Larry becomes a Chippendale dancer. Although he's already done the dancing thing. He's already done that. So, let's go back in the comedy club. So, uh... Let's save. File. Save. Alright, uh... Gotta, gotta get that wine. And hold on. Is there, is there music in here? No music. All right, look. World famous comedy hut. All right, look, man. Sitting at this table are Bill Skirvin and Al Lowe, deep in an esoteric discussion about 3D animated graphic adventure game design. Oh boy. So, uh, okay. Hmm. All right. So let's see. So now I'm supposed to just just talk to him. Hmm. All right. Talk to Al. Just say what you want to you. Say what say what you want to say. Well, okay. So what do I say to the designer of Leisure Suit Larry? You know, I think you know. You know, I think this works. <laughs> hey, I got an idea. How about if you and I sit in a comedy club and we make Larry walk up to us and say something like "fuck you." <laughs> nice, nice. Fuck you, huh? Says Bill. Are you crazy? No way, that's so lame. Larry would never say that. <laughs> yeah, I suppose you're right, says Al. That's no that's not a good idea. Let's get out of here. Fuck you, really? Uh what? <laughs> and then the the developers of the game just teleport out. They just beam out. <laughs> Alright. Mmm. Mmm. Fourth wall. So let's have a seat. Uh, okay, let's, hold on, let's have a seat, sit, take wine, you quietly cop some poor slob's bottle of fine wine, oh god, and now ladies and gentlemen, hey, it's time for Paul Paul, oh god, boo, you don't need to type the word boo to complete this game, uh, Oh, God. Good evening, ladies and germs, says Paul, always the snappy starter. Is it gonna be the same thing, or... Okay, we're gonna try something different tonight. Tell me the name of your three favorite ethnic... Oh, God. So, no, 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 say... How about... Oh, okay. You know what? Favorite ethnic groups. I'm not gonna sit through that again, alright? I'm not gonna sit through that again, but I am curious, like... Okay, like, so what if we get real offensive here, right? What if we get real offensive? Hmm. Yeah, there we go, there we go. Vietnamese, alright. Uh, second group, how about, uh, just, how about just the blacks? Uh, third is, I don't know, what's, what else? Um, I don't know. Gingers, there you go, gingers. Alright. I'm curious, like, let's see how that changes it a little bit. Alright, do you know how they take a census in a Vietnamese neighborhood? Easy! Flood the basements! Talk to Paul. 
Hey buddy, you shout. That material came over on the bounty. An elderly couple were just finishing their annual physical exam. Their doctor proclaimed them in perfect health. The wife said, but doctor, what can we do? I'm afraid we're gonna catch this AIDS virus. The doctor responded, yeah, you're not in a high risk group. But doctor, we do have annual sex. Uh, that, uh, uh. Oh God, yeah. Hey, did you hear about the black man who was so lazy? He married a pregnant woman? Uh, okay, let's, can I stand up? Do you know about how to get 25 ginger guys in a phone booth? Throw a dollar! Hey, don't you, don't you like my material? No. Okay. <laughs> oh god. Yeah, no, no, like, no, let's, let's get out. I just want to get out of the club. Get, let me out of here. Let me out. <laughs> let me out. There we go. There we go. Yeah, no, no, let's, that's, that's good. That's good. We've already done the comedy club thing once before, all right? <laughs> uh, but I love that. It's just, here's, have some ethnic jokes. Mm. Again, I feel like, I feel like Leisure Suit Larry just couldn't exist today, you know? I, I feel like you, although there is a modern remake of it, but I feel like in its purest form, Leisure Suit Larry just couldn't do it anymore. <laughs> um, all right, so let's see. I've, I've, uh... I've already sat through the comedy act, so now I need to go back to the casino, and upon entering, I have to go to the elevators, and I have to go to the ninth floor. Okay. That's where Patty's room is. Alright, otherwise, I guess, I, I guess I'd just be lost in the casino, huh? Alright. So yeah, let's, let's go ahead and get us, let, let's get us some passionate Patty. Mmm. We're gonna, gonna play Patty Cakes. Oh my. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, all right let me let me let me save first okay so we're we're uh we we got the wine <clears throat> so now we're about to get the get the something else all right i wonder what's that guy over there for the the guy doesn't say anything about talking to him so Talk man. Alright, you attempt to catch the clerk's attention. Excuse me. I'm sorry, sir, but this is a private hotel. Hmm. Ask about Patty? Okay, um. Uh, push button. So we gotta use us that elevator. Hmm. So which elevator's gonna come down here? It, it looks like the one on the left, <clears throat> I think. There we go. All right. So let's see, push nine. You insert Patty's penthouse key into the ninth floor penthouse access lock and turn it one quarter turn to the right. Both you and the elevator begin. Oh my God. Both you and the elevator begin to rise. Hmm. Oh yeah, I I'm feeling it. We're gonna 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 get in there. Oh yeah. Uh. Just you know, we got a nice little elevator ride. Just to listen to that elevator music. Man. Why she gotta be on the top floor? Mm. Okay. So, all right, all right. Ooh. I remembered to bring the wine, Patty. You announce. Yeah, I did get that wine, and I remembered to wear your lay, Larry. She smiles. All right, all right. So let's uh, let's pour that wine. Pour that wine. Hmm. You decide to place the bottle of wine on the silver tray resting on the table at the foot of the circular bed. Beside the two glasses Patty has thoughtfully provided for the occasion. Alright, come on. <clears throat> Perhaps I, I should explain. I have a history of not finishing what I begin. Just don't be surprised if something happens before we finish. Huh. Alright. 
right, all right. Rest assured, honey, I promise you, something will happen. Oh my. <clears throat> are we gonna, are we gonna, are we getting in there now? Would you care for a glass of wine? Hmm. I thought you'd never ask. But I'm really gonna need it. Hmm. Well, let's say when. Nice. <laughs> uh, okay, M missed one dialogue, that's fine. Alright, so hey, look, they get to have their nice wine. <clears throat> mm. Alright. Okay, yeah, all that wine. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, need lots of it. You need a whole lot. So, Patty, how did you get started in the music business? Shut up, Larry. <laughs> Nice. That's romance right there. See, I know how romance works, you know? <laughs> oh, Patty. And now she needs to say shut up again. Oh, Larry. Hmm. Oh, all the tender romance. Oh. Wherever did you learn to kiss like that? It, it's really not good. <laughs> Well, when I was younger, I did play trumpet in a mariachi band. <clears throat> I'm real good at blowing, if you know what I mean. I... Oh, oh, here we go, here we go! Tasteful fade to black. Oh, Larry. Oh, mm, mm, ah, oh, it's like, Larry, get your dick out of my mouth so I can say something. I... <laughs> no, no. Oh, ah, ah. Uh, I love the fade to black. Larry, you're the first man, ah, who's ever made me feel, mm, that way. Oh, oh goodness. It's like, no, down and a little to the left. Where did, uh, where did, uh, where'd you learn to do that? Uh, and that. And, oh yes, that, yes, that. Please, more of that. I'll have a side of fries with that. Well, Larry, perhaps you learned more from Kalalo than you realized. No longer is your is our Larry Laffer the the Laffer the Laffer lover. Uh. So we we're in. I <laughs> oh oh my God! What happened to your skin? Like what what happened to your skin? You've gone red. Your flesh is melting. Oh, that's wonderful. I didn't know pectorals could pulsate like that. Like, what happened to your flesh, Patty? You think to yourself, how ironic. Of all both the women I've known, this piano player turns out to be the greatest. Mm. Patty thinks to herself, how ironic. Of all the men I've had, this dork turns out to be the greatest. <laughs> oh man. Simultaneously, you each murmur into the other's ears. I never knew it could be this good! Shazam! <laughs> yeah. Look at that. Uh... <laughs> yeah, I thought she was dead for a second there. Mm. <laughs> uh... As Patty drifts off to sleep, you realize this is one woman who deserves her nickname. Mm. So, I mean, game over, right? I mean, we did good. <clears throat> I mean, where is there to go from here? This, we, like, Larry has gotten the woman of his dreams. I mean... Uh, yeah, look, the, the man of my dreams. I'm in love. There'll never be another woman for me. I, I think Leisure Suit Larry 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. I think that disagrees. <laughs> How I wish I still smoked. <clears throat> nice. <clears throat> the two of you drift off to sleep, bathed in the glow of your experience together. <clears throat> hmm. <laughs> 
That settles it. From now on, it's Larry Laffer forever. Tomorrow I must call my boyfriend and tell him I'm breaking off our relationship for good. Sorry, Arnold. The Arnold? Like... Like the governator? Uh, as she falls asleep, thinking about how she'll handle the end of her other relationship, Patty murmurs softly a single devastating word. Arnold. Uh, what? What? What did she say? Arnold? Arnold? Oh no! I thought she felt something. I know I felt it. During the best sexual experience of my life, she was thinking of another man. I'm so stupid. But now I should have learned. Some men have a way with women, and, and some men don't. Oh no. Oh no, this is making Larry second guess. I was a fool to believe my new body would make a difference. Nothing makes a difference. Once you're a loser, you're always a loser. Oh no. The paranoia sinks in. Oh god. I give up. I've had it with women. It's just not worth it. I'm going where no woman will ever frustrate me again. Oh man. Oh man, what a, what a, what a twist! So, so Patty fucked it up, and, and Larry is like, oh no, I'm out of here. <laughs> And yeah, Leisure Suit Larry 4 is a meme. Uh, hold your fire. It is. <laughs> anyway. Oh, look at that. Look at that! He's gone. He's gone! What happened? Where, where could he be? Oh no, I finally met the man of my dreams, and now he vanishes into thin air! Now what will I do? <laughs> Where is he? <laughs> oh look, Patty longingly looking for that Larry. Like suddenly this becomes like both a romantic comedy and just like a, a tender romance moment. Where could he go at this time of night? Also, Patty, you're like sunburnt or something. Yeah, like third degree burns. Why would he leave? Am I blind? How could I let him slip through my... Uh... Oh, there's a twinkle in the distance. Wait, what was that off in the distance? Way over there at that point. Was that a flash of white polyester? <laughs> hmm. All right. It's him! And, uh, man, like, Patty's becoming a bit of a stalker now. <laughs> but where is he going? There's nothing that way but uncharted bamboo forest! Hmm. He's gone, but it had to be Larry. His pulsating pectorals are recognizable anywhere. Oh wait, I guess, are we getting to the pursuit of pulsating pectorals now? Are we... Suddenly, everything seems so obvious, so simple. I must give up everything and find the man... And find my man. I, f I know my quest to find Larry Laffer. So, so d does the real Leisure Suit Larry 3 begin now? Um... Alright. So yeah, look, we're Patty now. Yeah, look, character swap. Character swap. We are now Patty. Um, okay, save game. Uh, yeah, Patty time. All right. So uh, let me see what I'm supposed to do here. Uh, let's look around first. You'll never be able to look at this suite again without thinking of your Larry. Hmm. Okay, so we have to. G oh boy. Hmm. Okay, so we got to get a couple of things. Uh, first off, do I still have my inventory? I have my key, and that's about it. Um, so, okay, we've got a changing station here. Uh, take off, is it a, a sheet? You're wearing it. Like, we have to change. Change. You're too smart for this game. Uh, un undress? Like, we have to, we have to change clothes. Um... Uh, 
We have to we have to change out of also I just noticed that she's wearing high heels, so she's just got like so wait, she, was she just wearing nothing but heels that that whole time? Alright. Like just in you know, sleeping in heels? Okay. Hmm. Okay, so let's see. We need to Okay, we need to specifically get items. So we need to get panties. Alright, you've always enjoyed the feeling of black lace. Uh, we need to get hose. All right, we got legs. Um, all right. Oh, we need to also get bra. Okay, get dress. All right, so you slide your dress over the screen and drop the sheet on the floor. Okay, we're good, right? Yeah, there we go. So Patty is properly dressed now. Okay, so we need to get the wine bottle and, and go back down to the lounge. All right, get wine. All right, all right. So time to go on a, on pursuit of those pulsating pectorals. All right, push one. Okay, going down, going down. Oh man, look at... They let you move around in the elevator too, that's awesome. <laughs> so yeah, hmm. I I gotta say, um Like that the game the game could have just ended right there. It really could have. But no, we're we we've got pursuit now. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, so so Patty is the pianist in the casino. So let's let's go and get our money. We need we need to get some cash to work with here. Mm. And yes, yes, I know. Input the game's name. It changed to Passionate Patty now. Mm. Little touches, little touches. Okay. So, all right. Ah, there's my tip jar over there. So let me let me get my tips. I I do seize it. I I do seize it. So get tips. Let's see. Did we have a good night tonight? Oh well, a few bucks is better than nothing. Where you're going, you're not gonna need a lot of money anyway. But I do need some money. So we got our tips. Um. So now I need to go to the. I need to get marker near entrance on board? What? Oh, you mean those, like, two pixels over there? Get marker. Alright, a magic marker. A girl never knows when she might need a little magic in her life. Like, that was literally, like, two pixels on the screen. There's no way you would ever think to do that. Um, okay. Uh, so I got the tip, I got the marker. So now I need to go. Oh, now I need to go to the Chippendales. Awesome. All right. <clears throat> so yeah, let's let's hit up the Chippendales. Hmm. Oh yeah. Also, let's look mirror. Yeah, you look your. You see yourself looking back. Oh hey. Bonus points. I I got some bonus points for doing that. Sweet, sweet, sweet. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> uh. <clears throat> okay, so we need to go to the Chippendales. I guess, I guess the Chippendales is open now. I I suppose that it's it's going to be open now. So yeah, let's let's hit up that Chippendales. Also, man, Patty, uh, whew, she's very top heavy. I just, I just kind of noticed that she's, she's real top heavy, yeah, frontally loaded, if you will. I, I guess that's what Leisure Suit Larry likes. So here we go. We got the Chippendales. We got us a Chippendales. So, talk, man. Hello, sir, you say to the doorman. 
Could you give me some information about the show inside? The maitre d' responds, Tonight's show is offered at the special low rate of only $25. Of course, with tax, that'll come to $42.95 exactly. Uh, how much money did I have again? Um... Tips. Feed the kitty. Uh... So I guess I'm supposed to give him money, right? Uh, let me just make sure. Yeah. Pay man. Here's all the money I have in the world, you say to the doorman. Boy, what luck! I just happen to have $43 in tips. Why, thank you very much, ma'am. I know you'll enjoy the show. Uh, oh hey, you know what? No, I'll save when I get inside. Alright, so, we're, we're, we're at the chips. Okay. So, oh, I lost my music. So, okay, we're at the Chippendales. What am- Why am I even here? I don't know. Um, hmm. Okay, so let's see. So I need to... I need to have a seat. Sit. The chair not only faces the wrong way, but has a re reserve sign on it. However, the chair beside it is unoccupied. Okay, sit. You're not close- what do, what do you mean I'm not close enough? I'm right- I'm right here! Sit. There we go. <clears throat> Alright, so there's something specific that we have to do here, okay? Ladies- ladies and ladies, says the voiceover announcer, Chippendales is proud to present in person tonight only for one show only, the first, the original, the greatest, the owner, Dale! Oh my. Okay, so- so there's a specific thing we have to do here. Um, hmm. Okay, okay. So, so here's here's what we gotta do. All right. So Dale's gonna get out and start dancing. Oh yeah! Look, there we go. There we go. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! So we gotta throw our panties at him. Throw panties at Dale. Yeah, you slip off your Saturday night specials and readjust your pantyhose, all in one smooth movement. Nice, nice. Yep, smooth, smooth. Hey, look at him gyrating. Hey, Dale, you cry. These are for you. Like, why is Patty doing this? You shriek. Take me, big boy. I'm yours. Like, wh what about Larry? What about Larry? Uh. Ooh. Okay, ladies, let's really hear. Let's really hear for him. Isn't he wonderful? Nice. I mean, hey, look, we've we've been getting lots of cheesecake this whole game. So hey, here's your beefcake, I guess. I, I guess here's your beefcake. Alright, so we did that, and now it says, when he walks into the crowd, I have to talk to him. Um, hmm. Ah, here we go. Patty, look, it's him, Dale. He's here, walking through the audience. Talk to Dale. Oh, Dale, you coo. Would you like to join me? Nice. Hey, that was you that threw some lovely little pair of panties at me, wasn't it? Dale asks. You look lonely. Would you like a little company? Get over here and shake your dick in my face! Uh, no, no. Um, so talk to- can we look at him? Like, look at Dale. Hello, handsome, you tell the male stripper. My name is Patty, but you may call me passionate. Nice. Thanks, Patty, he responds, and you may call me Dale. <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah, look at that handsome motherfucker, mm. all right, that is a beard right there, that's a, that's an, that's an Al Lowe beard, anyway, uh, talk to Dale, I, I, I know my motto, don't get caught without a drink in your hand, 
so... Uh... Mm. Okay, well, it just says I'm supposed to talk to him, so... <laughs> yeah! Alright, talk to Dale again? So, Dale, is there any way through that treacherous bamboo forest that lies to the north of the village? <clears throat> oh, right, that. Patty, all I can say is, when all else fails, read your manual. Uh... Alright. Huh. Hmm. Um. Okay. Talk to Dale again. Okay, I guess that's all he has to offer. Um. Hmm. Fuck Dale! Oh! He didn't like that. No way, Patty! I know your reputation. As soon as you show me a clean bill of health, I'll consider your offer. Wait, wait, what? Patty has a reputation? Like, wait, what? Are, are we a hoe? Uh, oh no. Okay, well, um, I like that it recognized fuck, but yeah, let's, uh, let, let's, let's leave. Been a pleasure talking with you, Dale. Hope you get your man, Patty. Nice. Alright. Yeah, it's just Billy Mays, so let's stand, and let's get out of here. What a show, huh, honey? Slurps the maitre d'. How about that deal? Yeah. Alright, so let's save. Okay, read the manual. Um, So, okay, we did that, so now we need to go right... And, uh, we have to walk through the bamboo forest following the- wait, we have to walk through the bamboo forest following the tune in the manual. Hmm. Wait, use the first letter of each word and follow that direction. Okay, they just spell it out for me, that's good. That's good. So yeah, like, he basically just wanted you to read the manual, which... We did that. We- we read the manual. Well, I mean... The, the hint guide is just going to tell us anyway, so, okay, manual. So, we got to go, um, north, south, well, let me see, let me get into the maze first. Okay, so we're, we're in the, the bamboo maze, I think, or are we not in the maze yet? Um, hmm. <clears throat> okay, so... I think we're in the bamboo maze now, or or are we not? Um, so assuming that, hmm. Okay, assuming, so we went north and now we'd go south, right? Okay, no, I think, okay, so we're not actually in the bamboo maze just yet. Yeah, I'm, it's hard to tell, hard to tell. Look. Dangerous cliff, a bamboo thicket. Walk into bamboo. Uh... Hmm. Walk through bamboo forest. The hell you say? Uh... Um... Here we go. Bamboo forest maze. Are you ready for a forest maze? Okay. So first we gotta go north. Okay, so we go north. Oh, wait. Wait, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, no, the it doesn't actually spell it out, so we have to use the manual. Um, okay, so I need to find... Okay, I need to find a tune in the manual. Alright. So, let me, let me pop my manual up again. Hmm. Where's my manual at? Here we go. Hmm. <laughs> uh, Alright, so let's see, let's see. Uh, so there's supposed to be- it says to follow the tune in the manual. Uh, where is the tune in the manual? There's actually a couple of tunes in the manual. Um... 
there's actually a couple of tunes in here. Uh-oh. Oh boy, there's, uh, there's actually a couple of tunes in the manual, and like... Mmm. Like, okay, I wonder if it's spelled out in the other guide. Okay, here we go, the other guide spells it out just fine. So, uh, let me, let me use that as a reference instead of this one. Okay. So, alright. We go north. North again. Hmm. <laughs> uh. Alright, so we go north, we go north again. Then... Then, we go east-east. Boy, I could use a good belt about now, you think to yourself. East. Hmm. Okay. So we go east and then east again. And also, apparently I'm gonna get thirsty, but I, I shouldn't, uh... I don't- I shouldn't drink water until I'm at the point of crawling. So, alright. So we go east, east, then north, n okay, north, west, north, so north, is this north, north, west, okay, <clears throat> man, this is, uh, this is some good copy protection right here, okay, west, then north again, I'm sweating worse than a jazz clarinetist at a, in a cowboy bar, oh boy. Okay, so northwest north. We should be able to go north again. Patty's not looking so hot. Mm. Okay, we went north. So that was northwest north, then east. North, north, north. Alright. And look, Patty's gonna die. Alright, east. And then north, north, north. Man. Okay, north again. Ah, uh, man. <laughs> so north, north. Hmm. Uh, yeah, I'll go ahead and save now, right? Maze. So I think north one more time here. Alright, one more time north. And then we go west, west, south. Alright, so west, west, south. Hmm. Okay, that's west, and then west again. Also, we, ap we appear to be crawl- like, oh no, Patty's on hands and knees, uh-oh. Uh, let's let's save again. Uh, maze two. Uh, do I have like I don't have I have an empty bottle. Oh crap! Wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. Did I miss something? Did I miss something? Hmm. Okay, I have not missed anything. Okay, so west west. And then, yeah, west, west, then south, west, west. So west, west, now we go south. Oh. Okay, so now we go south, then west, west again. Hmm. Yeah, Patty's dying. Oh boy, she's still jiggling, though. She's still jiggling. Why is everything here shaped like a swizzle stick? Why am I crawling around like this? Why am I talking to myself? I'M DELIRIOUS! <laughs> uh, okay, so we go west-west. Yeah, west-west, and then north-north. North-north, not north-north. Uh, okay, west-west. And there should be a river bank. There, there should be a river bank that we can- Oh no! Oh no! Patty is- Oh, she's reduced to crawling around at a snail's pace. Just- Oh no, just, just ass up. Oh, oh goodness. 
Oh goodness. I <laughs> Okay, west west, then north north. And the 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 music the music is slowing down too. Oh no. Come on, Patty, you can do it. Okay. No, no, gotta go up a little bit more. There we go. Alright. West, west. You are feeling very tired and thirsty. You almost have no energy left. As you take leave of your withered, dehydrated body, you wonder, is this what it's like to, to play Cleveland? Oh, I'm dead. Patty, you, mu you really must start packing more sensibly when you take these little outings of yours. Hmm. Like, wait a second. Okay, there, so there was supposed to be a, a river. Um, there was supposed to be water. Uh, hold on. Like, there was supposed to be water somewhere. Hmm. Huh. Okay, I see what we did wrong. Keep on muddling. Restore. So, okay, apparently the, the the river is not in the maze, it's right before the maze. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, so that's a fail state. That's a fail state. So apparently uh, there's supposed to be a little river, like a, a mountainside river or something. Mm. Yeah, hold on. Let's see. Water. It says, the mountain stream, walk to the edge of the water, and drink water. Go north to the next screen at the rock up the edge of the cliff. Hmm. It, okay, no, the guide doesn't say anything about water. It, um, none of the guides say anything about where you acquire water. Um, get water? Drink water. Nobody's that thirsty. Like, all I have is my empty- I have an empty bottle, which I assume I can put water in it, right? Hmm. There is a water fountain earlier on in the game. Maybe I can fill that with water. Hmm. But, so here's- here's the thing. Um, like, I have- I have two guides open, and neither guide says anything about water. About where you get the water. Uh get water um, yeah like none of the guides say anything about they all say to drink water at that particular moment but none of them say anything about where you're supposed to get water from because you don't have water in your inventory at this point so I'm thinking it's gonna be at the water fountain I, I figure the water is gonna be from the water fountain next to the casino you know just just fill up the bottle with water Yeah, but it's like I have to find a clean water source is the thing, and I guess the I, I guess the water fountain next to the changing stalls? I guess that would be a, an acceptable place. Hmm. Alright. Drink water. Well, there we go. Ah. Fill bottle with water. You place your bottle under the tap while carefully considering the level of carcinogenic compounds therein. Alright. Okay, so now I have a bottle of water. Okay. See, none of the guides say anything about filling it up at the fountain. They all... So, like, all of the guides, they just... They just skip over that part, and they don't, they don't mention it at all. Um... So yeah, like, even if you follow the walkthrough to the letter, you still get stuck in a fail state. That's great. That's, uh, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. Mm. Okay. Man, I... I sure do love Sierra Adventure games. I sure do. Mmm. So yeah, yeah. Let's uh, let's do that forest maze all over again. Hmm, that's gonna be fun. But this time we can, uh, yeah, this time we can survive the maze. Hmm. 
<laughs> Alright, I guess I was looking at the wrong walkthroughs then. I was I was using the official Sierra help document. Alright, the official walkthrough of Sierra, and that doesn't say anything about it. I also just looked at like, um, uh, I think it, what is it? No, it's not Game Facts, it's Cheat Book. Cheat Book, but like, it was like one of the big hits that I got looking for it. And yeah, neither neither one. Look, if the official Sierra hint book or hint walkthrough doesn't mention it, then like, what hope is there, right? What hope is there if even the official document mentions nothing about it? <laughs> okay, let's do the maze. All right, uh, walk through bamboo forest. Uh, or I guess I just yeah. Okay. So, starting over, north north. All right, let's keep it simple. <laughs> All right, we got to got to find Gino in here. <laughs> okay, so that's north then north again. Then east east. Okay. Let's try to be time. Oh yeah, also I wonder, let's change the game speed faster. There we go. Like, we, we just made the game a little bit faster. Yay. That'll help. Um, east. And east again. Hmm. Okay, now northwest north. Yeah, and I can use a belt. But it says, like, don't, don't drink until you're, you're crawling. So that's north, then west, then north. Hmm. Okay, so that's north, west, and north. N, W, N, and then, then we go east. Hmm. Okay, and now we go east, north, north, north. Hmm. Uh, I, I don't know the Easter egg. I've, I've died once in the jungle, though. <laughs> I just want to complete the game. Uh, so that's east, then north, north, north. All right. Okay, so now we go north, north, and north. Hmm. And north one more time. All right. Now we go west, west, south. Hmm. Uh, no, you I wanna, I wanna, I, I wanna finish up Vampire at some point. I said I was gonna do that, so, so we're doing Vampire again, cause that's, it is a linear story, and we wanna get through it. Oh, what is this? Oh yeah, she'd like a cocktail lounge. Hmm. All right, so we're going west, west, south. Hmm. Okay, west, west, south. Then, then we go west, west. Okay, west, west, yeah, yeah, Patty's crawling. Uh, let's see if I can speed the game up again. Faster. There we go. You, you gotta get, gotta get her crawling a little bit quicker there. So, we go west and west again. Hmm. Alright. Then we go north, north, west, north. Everything here is, is shaped like a swizzle stick, yep. So that's, uh, we did our west-west, now we do our north-north. North-north, west-north. Oh, hey, panty shot, panty shot. Uh, so let's, now let's drink the water. Drink water. There we go. Alright, blindly celebrating your thirst crazed delirium, you throw the now empty wine bottle far out into the bamboo thicket in protest of bottle bill laws everywhere. Okay, so we're going north north, west north. Alright, that's north north and west north. And I think we'll be okay I think this'll be it. West and north. Yeah, this is we're on linear path here. Linear path. You did it! Yeah! Hmm. Alright.
right, here we go, here we go. As you stumble out of the bamboo forest, you find yourself beside a beautiful stream. Okay, so we did it. We made it... We made it past forest. Okay. Um, and yeah, I'm using a walkthrough, but it's just... I'm using a walkthrough because I've already hit several fail states, so I'm... Yeah, no, we're just doing it. <laughs> I want to see the end. Um, okay, so now... Okay, I, I did I did the forest maze. Um, I drank the water. Okay, I saved, so now I need to drink some water. Okay, so... Oh, oh right! Oh, right! <laughs> oh, right, yeah. That's why the guide wants you to save. Isn't it difficult to swim upstream, especially when upstream is uphill? Okay. Yep. Yep. Alright, so we're at the stream now. So we need to... What do we do with the stream? We need to drink some water. Okay. Drink water. You're not clip. Drink water. Drink water. Please tell me I'm close enough. Oh god. Drink water. There we go. Uh, okay, you find the stream's water remarkably refreshing, refreshing without a trace of caffeine. Uh, mm. uh. I was supposed to smoke the hemp. Oh man. Well, I like. Well, let's look around. What do we got? Uh. Okay. I mean, I don't know. <laughs> but, but. Okay, so we drank the water. We drank the water. So I'm I'm being careful go by guide here. Um Okay, so we went to the edge of the river. We drank our water. So now we just go north, all right? We're I, I guess no more maze, right? So I I still want to save constantly because I'm I'm a little paranoid like that. Also, the sound just Okay, hold on. The sound kind of dies every now and then when you save your game. So let me uh, let me restore. There we go. That that clears it. So let's look. You are near the edge of a dramatic cliff. The river beside you hurls over the edge, forming a spectacular waterfall and disappearing into the canyon below. All right. So what am I supposed to do with this thing? Um. Hmm. Okay, I've gone to the edge of the river. I've drank the water. Huh. Huh. Oh, thanks for no. So okay, the um hmm. So apparently, I'm supposed to. Okay. Apparently, I'm supposed to remove hose. Yeah. So I'm supposed to re remove the pantyhose. Tie hose to rock. There is a rock here that is suitable for your purposes. You're just unable to reach it from here. Uh, and like, which rock am I supposed to be tying it to? Tie hose to rock. Ah. You remove your pantyhose, tie one leg to the tip of the large rock, tie the other around your waist, and then lower yourself carefully over the edge of the cliff. Why did I do that? I don't know. You hope these are support hose. You lower yourself and an experience not wholly unfamiliar to you over the sheer side of the canyon wall. Your full weight supported only by a pair of of run-filled pantyhose. How you wish you changed to a clean pair this morning. Oh. Okay. Huh. Uh, oh no! <laughs> Splat. You slowly recover from your near-tragic pantyhosing and try to remember why you are here. Wait, that didn't kill her? Of course, it's Larry you're seeking. You bring yourself back to your feet, ready to again resume your quest for the man of your dreams. Huh. Huh. Also, she left a boob imprint. Uh, okay, okay. Hmm. 
I, uh, all right. Also, hey there, Nox. Hey there. Um, so, okay, I did that. I did that. Um, so now... Okay, now I need to get plants. Okay, so get plants. You're not close enough. Get plants. Okay. Get plants. Okay, you gather a few choice products from Dr. Nonoki's garden of unearthly delights. Oh, hey, we're we're back in back in that area, huh? So we got the hemp then, right? Are you sure this is something you should be doing? Okay, so we got the hemp, I guess. Um, let me take a look. Uh, so we've got- we have the- the Maria Juana! Patty, shame on you. Don't you know marijuana's illegal? What do you plan to do with this stuff? Oh no, it's that devil weed! Okay, so let's save game here. Alright, let's save game. Uh, okay. And let me load so that I have- uh, let me- let me load so I've got, you know... There we go, I got my music. So... Okay... Hmm... Huh... S smoke... Sm smoke marijuana? Okay! Nice! You quickly dry a few leaves in the sun, pull a pack of rolling papers from your bra, and place the leaves in the paper while professionally executing a one-handed roll. Nice. Grabbing a couple of rocks, you slap them together until you make a spark that ignites your joint. <laughs> nice. Very nice. Hmm. What? You begin to get a little buzz on. What's happening? This stuff makes you feel like you're floating. Oh, man. <laughs> Let me guess, we're gonna float over the cliff and die. Looking down, you notice, yeah, you're floating. Cool, dude. You see visions of Daventry! What? What? Wait, what? Visions of Daventry. Uh. Better not be King's Quest VIII. Oh, bogus. Is this stuff wearing off? Oh, goddamn Sierra! Remember, Patty, next time, just say no. Uh. Yeah, who told you the law of gravity had been repealed? Oh, there. <laughs> okay, okay. Yeah, so don't do that. We want to weave the marijuana. There we go. <laughs> that was just great. That was that was a pretty good Easter egg. Okay. Okay. Cleverly remembering that an original legal use of marijuana was in the manufacturing of hemp rope, you take the marijuana you have harvested and carefully weave it into a rope. However, or fortunately, you picked enough so your rope is just slightly longer than the distance across that chasm. All right. In other words, our little Muhammad Ali has made her own dopa rope. Okay. So I've got my marijuana rope. Um, ooh, okay, apparently I'm supposed to do something else too. I'm supposed to uh, climb tree. Climb tree. You wrap your slender thighs tightly around the long cylindrical trunk. An experience not wholly unfamiliar to you. It's like, Patty, stop being a slut. Damn it, just, just I just want you to climb the tree. So, so Patty is basically, uh, yeah, she, she is our, our femme leisure suit Larry. All right. So let's get cocoa, uh, get cocoa nuts. All right. So, reaching beneath the palm tree's frond kilt, you gr Wait, okay. Reaching beneath the palm tree's frond kilt, you grab a pair of large, brown, hairy nuts. If it says a f An experience not wholly unfamiliar to you. Yes, yes. Pa Patty, god damn it, Patty. Alright, alright. So, we've climbed the tree. Um... <laughs> Uh, okay, okay, so I've climbed the tree, I've gotten the coconuts, climb down, climb down. <laughs> yeah, that was just, mmm, mmm, perfect, perfect. Okay, uh, so we, we got the, we got the big hairy nuts and all that, um, 
let's save again, okay? After getting the the hairy nuts, uh, let's. All right, so I have my music, okay? Um, so I got the nuts. Now I need to throw the rope across the chasm. Throw rope across chasm. Uh, are we doing it? Giving it everything you've got, you hurl the rope as hard as you can. Ah. Okay. You've lassoed the rope on the far side of the canyon. The uh, the rope on the far. You've lassoed the rock on the far side of the canyon. Okay. So now tie rope to tree. There we go. Although your previous experience with knots has been limited to fashion accessories, plus a few weekends spent on yachts and ports around the world, serving as deckhand au naturel, you tie the rope to the palm tree as, secu as securely as you can. Okay, so we did that. Um, hmm. Okay. Wait a second. Oh, okay, so ap apparently I'm supposed to rip dress. Huh. Good idea, Patty. You discreetly remove approximately eight inches from the hem of your dress. Just enough so when you climb on your rope, you'll have a safety harness for your security. Ah, okay, okay. That makes sense, I suppose. Um, all right, all right. So, yeah. So now, I think I'm ready to cross the rope without dying horribly, I think. Um, okay. Um, yeah, we're good. Cross chasm. Before climbing onto the rope, you slip into your safety harness. It'll be strong enough to hold you. You wrap your long, delicate pianist fingers and your long, delicate pianist legs around your handmade rope, squeezing your legs t tightly together an experience wholly unfamiliar to you. Okay, so this... <laughs> Alright, you move out over the canyon. Alright. You feel certain your informal safety harness will help you pass safely over the canyon. Okay, now hold on. Hold on, let's see. Is this gonna help me, or... Hmm. Hmm. Okay, I think we're good. Are your feelings correct? Oh, man. Crossing the chasm. <laughs> Your improvised safety harness works. You feel you may be able to make it all the way across. Nice. All right. And there's a bird. Okay. Hmm. I, I think we did it. You did it, Patty! But now you wonder if there's something you forgot before you left. Of course! You could always take the rope back again! Nice. Patty, you're not around the tree the palm tree came loose. Now there's no way for you to turn back. Uh, I hope that was, uh... Huh. I hope progress... So, like, wait, wait, did I miss a step here? Did I not... Like, hold on. Did I- did I miss a step? Hmm, I tied the tree to the rope. Yeah, okay, I think I did everything right. Um, hmm. Okay, so we have to save, and now we have to walk north on the left side. Okay, I guess the save is so that, just in case, you know, so you don't fall off, right? Hmm. Okay, so we left along along okay so walk north on the left side Rem okay remove bra ah that feels better put coconuts in bra you are now holding a bra containing a pair of heavy coconuts now what o okay um all right that's the thing you got to do um, so now I need to walk towards the river. Okay. Oh, look out! Uh-oh, uh-oh, what? Once again, Patty, you find- Once again, Patty, you find yourself being porked. God damn it. 
an experience not wholly unfamiliar to you. Uh... So, so what is... Is the implication that, like, a wild boar just popped out of the forest and, like... It... It... it is Patty getting raped by a boar now? I mean, like, what's the implication? Um, alright. So, yeah, okay. Um... Huh. Okay, I guess I missed a little thing here, so... Remove bra. Put coconuts in bra. There we go. So now we save again because this I guess could get could get tricky. Could could get tricky. All right, so the moment I see a pig, I need to throw the coconut bra. Throw bra at pig. Look out. I I I don't e I don't even have the option to throw anything. Oh god, getting porked again. Oh no, oh no. I mean, well, oh wait, wait a second. Wait a second. I just noticed that like when the when the pig thing, when the pig man thing pops out of the the jungle, I just noticed like okay, Patty like she goes face down and the the pig is like going like back and forth real f oh god, oh god. Is the implication she's getting fucked by a wild boar? Is that really the implication here? Oh my. Oh my Leisure Suit Larry. I love it. Okay. So, yeah, um... I gotta watch out for the pig man. No, I don't want to save here. I want to watch out for pig mans. Okay. I look out. It's one of Nun Tonight's Island's rare feral pigs ex exercising its territorial rights right at you. Uh, throw bra at pig. Okay, okay. Yeah. You did it, Patty. Your 36C bolus has done its duty. But have you noticed how you're running dangerously low on clothing? I have noticed that. Yeah, like... Yeah, we, uh... Yeah, wait, we had to use our panties t t on Dale. We had to use the bra for that. We had to use the, the pantyhose for the rock. Uh, we had to rip up our dress, so, like, I, I guess, yeah, we're... We're gonna be naked by the end of this, aren't we? Alright. Leisure Suit Larry. Okay, so I did the thing with the bra. Okay, I did that. Um... So, now we need to walk north and walk into the water towards Log. Look. In the distance, a river runs downhill. You expected maybe uphill. Ah, okay, okay. So this is another one of those you can die really, really easily here. So. Okay, so I, I see the log. I see it. Okay, push log. Push log. What do you mean I'm not close enough? Push log. There we go. All right, all right. Uh, uh, okay, okay, hold on, hold on. Do I have to, like, type swim now, or... Hmm. Okay, so I push the log. Get, I have to get on, get on log. There we go, there we go. Okay, you mount the gnarly log. An experience not wholly unfamiliar to you. I love it. You did it! The current has caught your log and is taking you downstream toward your Larry. Alright. Press 8 to F8 to bypass the next seat. Well, hold on, what are we doing here? Get on log, save. The, the river is an arcade sequence! Save frequently! I. Okay. Oh god! Oh no! Well, I'm dead. Don't you just hate arcade games? <laughs> oh god. Okay, push log. So yeah, this is an arcade sequence that's coming up. 
All right, we we got us an arcade sequence. Um, save. Get on log. All right. So yeah, I mean, I I guess we're gonna do an arcade sequence. Let's do it. Let's do it. Oh god. Oh god. It's actually kind of. It's way too quick. Is the problem. Uh, it's way too quick. Get on log. All right, look, I, I want to try the arcade sequence, all right? I know I can skip it, but I want to try it. Okay, come on. Oh, oh god, oh god. Oh, man, it, it's, it's a little too fast. It's a little too fast for me. Um, I think it's the cycles or something, but... Yeah, let's just let's just skip it. We you've seen the arcade minigame. You've seen it, you know what happens. <laughs> Alright. So yeah, we'll F8 to skip it. Alright, F8 to bypass the next scene. I'm 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 pressing I'm pressing F8 and it doesn't bypass it. Oh god. Oh god, there's no Oh god, there's no bypassing the scene. Oh god. Apparently this apparently it doesn't recognize my F8 key. Um Apparently it doesn't recognize my F8. Oh no. Like, it doesn't recognize F8 on my keyboard. It doesn't recognize it. So, uh... Yeah, guess what? I, I think we're doing it. Um... Okay, well, time to... Yeah, time to do it. Ah, oh, the, the key... It's, it's also kind of unresponsive. That's, that's another problem. It, it's kind of unresponsive. <laughs> Oh boy. Oh, oh wow, okay, so the, the logs kind of follow you. The the logs kind of follow you, okay. So I guess staying in the middle is the best idea. Like, I, I guess staying in the middle and then... I, it's way too fucking fast. It's way too fast. Uh, let me, let me slow the game down a little bit. Alright? Like, I'm, I'm slowing the game down. Let's hope I can... It's it's still way way too fast. It's still way too fast. Oh god, is it way too fast? No, I don't want to start back at the beginning. Oh, god damn. Okay. Yeah, like F8 doesn't do nothing. F8 F8 don't do nothing. Um Oh, I wow, I I actually didn't even have time to like, I was looking at the my F8 key there for a second. Oh god, let's do it. Ah, it, it... I hate this. I really hate this. I really hate this. It's way, way too goddamn fast on my PC. It's way too fast on a modern PC. Like, it's... A lot of games have this problem where it's just, you know, on a modern PC, even through DOSBox with cycle, it's it's too it's too fast. It's just too fast, and it's not responsive either. I hit the left key and it didn't do anything. I hit the left key and nothing happened. Hmm. Oh, okay. There we go. Okay, there we go. There we go. You hit F8 while you're in the scene and it skips ahead. Okay. Thank God. Thank God. You finally make your way past all the obstacles and arrive at a pleasant little clearing. This might be a good spot to take a short rest. You look for a place to beat your trusty log. Hmm. Look out! What? What have they done to you, Patty? Uh-oh. Uh-oh! God damn, Sierra! You've been captured by none tonight's famous tribe of Amazonian... Amazonian women lesbian cannibal natives. Oh boy. Now what will you do? How will you ever find your Larry? On the other hand, where do they find such stylish outfits way out here in the wilderness? So we've been we've been captured by cannibal lesbians. Alright. Oh my. I, I think I've seen a few movies about this before. <laughs> uh Okay. Knocked unconscious, securely wrapped in the Amazonian women's cannibal net, 
You hang over her shoulder like a sack of potatoes in an army mess. Hmm. All right. And oh no, they're whipping men too. Oh, oh, Patty, where will they take you? What will they do to you? What will happen to you? And will there be a hairdresser afterwards? <laughs> uh. You are jostled through the village, paraded about the square, handled roughly, battered and bruised, and then placed into a cage made of bamboo and leather. An experience not wholly unfamiliar to you. Uh. All right. You fondly recall a blind date when you were at Juilliard. <laughs> As you slowly regain consciousness, the blackness leaves your brain and you realize you are no longer tied up in that net, but something tells you you are no longer alone. Hey, it's Larry! Patty, it's you! True love! <laughs> uh. hmm. Alright, alright. So, how are we gonna get out of this? Oh, oh, Larry, I missed you. Oh, Patty, I missed you. Oh, look. Oh, true love. True love. Oh, Larry, I just couldn't believe you left. You can't believe how it felt to finally... to have finally found a perfect match and then to have you disappear into thin air. I awakened to an empty bed, rushed to the balcony, and saw you disappear through that horrible bamboo forest. So I started out after you, and I found you. We're together again, at last, and this time, to stay. But tell me, Larry, why did you go? Whatever caused you to leave like that? Oh, uh, romance. You, you did, Patty. After the most fantastic night of my life, just as I was drifting away into a blissful sleep, I heard you murmur one word, Arnold. Why, Patty? If I'm so special, why would you speak someone else's name? Weren't you thinking of him? Were you thinking of him while we made love? Oh, Larry, you wonderful, fragile fool. I was thinking of him because I was trying to figure out how to tell him I was going to leave him for you. Patty, I'm a fool, but what's the difference? At last we understand. We both feel the same for each other. We'll be together for the rest of our lives, like, you know, maybe 15 minutes. <laughs> Speaking of which, you did come here to rescue me, didn't you? You do have some sort of plan, don't you? You didn't travel all this way just so you could join me for dinner in their stomachs, did you? Uh, well, just a minute, you, you stall. I'm, I'm sure I'll think of something. You'd better think fast, Larry responds. I think these gals have got something cooking, and it's gonna be us. Alright, so let's save. Okay, uh, reun reunited, reunited. <laughs> so, yeah, okay, um, so, specifically, what am I to do here? Um, hmm, o okay, use marker, Larry, I don't think, I don't know if this will work or not, but the only thing I can think of is this magic marker pen, I picked it up back in the lounge, let's see if I can draw us a way out of this mess. Because it's magic marker, get it? Patty, you did it! At, at least you did something! What is that, a magic door? Like, this is Sierra logic, so... So if you didn't get the two pixel long marker back in the casino, you wouldn't have the magic marker to do this. I... Because you have to use the magic marker to make a magic door to escape the cannibal lesbians, I... Uh... This is Sierra Moon logic right here, at its finest. I don't know, Larry, but from the looks of things hereabouts, I don't want to stay around here. Come on, let's get out of here. I'm right behind you, honey, Larry responds. See you on the other side. Uh, God damn Sierra! <laughs> That's my catchphrase. Patty! All right, we escaped the cannibals. Oh, oh God. God damn, Sierra, I'm falling. Larry, what happened? Oh. 
Oh no. I don't know, Patty, but it feels like we just fell out of the game. Oh no, we've fallen through the world. Uh-oh. <laughs> yeah, we've fallen out of world. The question is, where will we end up? Uh, oh my god, we're in police quest! Meanwhile, back at Sierra Studios, workers are busy filming yet another exciting episode in the never-ending saga of Sunny Bonds and the citizens of Light in California, USA. Oh my god, it's police quest. <laughs> We've fallen into police quest! Alright. Quiet on the set, please. Music! Lights! Oh god, it's a little city map. Camera! Like, I just played police quest, so this is awesome. Action. No oh, look, look, there's a little- Yeah, look, they're moving the little cars around on the- So that's how they do it. <laughs> so that's how they did it in police quest. <laughs> Oh god. It, I feel like we've gone full meta here. <laughs> Alright, Craig, look out! Get out of here! Oh no! <laughs> nice. Oh. Watch out, Godzilla Larry, or you'll destroy the city of Lighten! Oh no! <laughs> oh. Very nice. Very nice. Wow, some guys really know how to make an entrance. Hmm. Staggering to his feet, Larry surveys your new surroundings. Hmm. <clears throat> Larry spots you lying motionless on the floor beneath the miniature city of Lighten. Patty, are you okay? He cries. Hmm. I guess so, you reply, but if I keep doing my own stunts like this, I'm gonna end up flat-chested. <laughs> Alright. Come on, Larry, you say. Let's get from let's get out from under here. Alright. Hmm. But what is this place, Larry? you ask. Good question, he replies, although it does seem familiar. You take the lead, Patty. Let's explore. So like what, are we in like Sierra Online Studios right now? This is like, this is... Okay, so it... So it says, uh... Okay, from here, uh... Okay, hmm... Huh... Well, I, I guess let's look around. Studio C! Well, first off, let's look around. You are backstage at the Sierra Studios. From the looks of things, they are filming another in the series of Police Quest games. Or they were until you two dropped in. Oh god. What is this? Look. This must be Sierra's prop stage room, prop storage room. Look at all the old flats and and backdrops in that rack. Oh my god, it's just like all the sets. It's it's all the sets from like various Sierra games. Oh man. What what's happening right now? Oh no, a giant magnet. God damn, Sierra! You shout. Now what? We're weightless! Larry yells. Um. I can still move. I can. I can still move. Um. So I. I what is happening here? Larry's going into outer space up there. Um. Oh god. Oh god. So I'm, I'm trying to get over there to the thing. Oh man, I like the music here! Okay, pull plug. You must be upside down in order to reach where the plug is at. Pull plug. Pull plug! There we go! I like the music! That I, it's a fun little sequence, I have to say. So yeah, um... Look, Larry, you cry. I did it. The anti-gravity generator is unplugged. Wait a minute, Patty. Larry yells. There's no anti-gravity. Uh, oh. Oh my god, Patty. Oh, look, they're both ass up. And for Patty, that means she's bare ass up. Oh no. Oh no. Wow, Patty. That was a rough one. What next? Oh, what are we even doing? I love this. This is how you end a video game right here. Like, imagine, you know what, like, just imagine if, I don't know, you're playing, like, um, 
what is a new adventure game? Like, I don't know, like imagine, you know, like the Walking Dead games, if you got to the end and then it's like, it, it all turned out to just be a film studio and, you know, and you had shenanigans backstage, like, oh my god. You know, I, I like this kind of thing. Oh look, truck that camera left. Hmm. No, no, move back. I recognize this scene from a King's Quest game, I think? Good, good, that's fine. Stop right there, barks the woman in the director's chair. Turning to the actress on the set, yeah, she says, Now, Rosella, what do you say we take it again from the top? And this time, really show me some emotion. And action. <laughs> like, so every single Sierra game you've ever played is, it's all just like, it's all an act. Cut, that's no good. Try it from the right side this time. Nice. Nice. <laughs> oh, I don't even know what's happening and I love it. And action. Hmm. And she falls again. Oh. No, cut, you slipped again, Rosella. Uh, like, can can we hit on Rosella now? <laughs> and action! Huh. Oh, God damn it! Cut, how many times must we do this? Rosella, you must get all the way up to the uvula! What's going on here, Patty? Whispers Larry. I don't know, Larry, but that girl certainly seems tired of going down on that tongue. Hmm, that, uh... <laughs> this just isn't right, whines the actress on the giant tongue set. It's too humid in here. This wool skirt keeps soaking up water. That goo you spread on the tongue is too slippery. You haven't given me my motivation for this scene yet. <laughs> Thank you very much, Rosella, interrupts the woman in the director's chair. Oh, the, that would be Roberta Williams. If you have any other complaints, please don't let me stop you. Well, yes I do, she pouts, pointing directly at you and Larry. I thought this was a closed set. Who are those two people over there? Uh, Cut, break, ten minutes, people, she shouts to the crew. With an angry glare, she turns toward you and Larry. And who are you? What are you doing here? How did you get in? Come over here, right now. Oh boy. It's... It's Roberta. It's, it, like, is this our, you know, and now we meet, like, now we meet God, right? Because we're Sierra Adventure Game characters, and this is Roberta Williams, so I, I guess... Are, are, are you God? <laughs> As you move closer, you recognize the woman in the director's chair. Why, Larry, look, it's Roberta Williams! Uh, oh, oh God, Zipper Roberta Williams, no. <laughs> to her, you cry, Oh, Miss Williams, I've loved your games for years. What an honor this is to finally meet my software hero. Nice. Roberta, Roberta softly softens noticeably. Well, yes, I, uh, I am Roberta Williams, but who are you? Well, Roberta, I'm Passionate Patty, the world-famous lounge pianist. The gentleman to your right is my lover. His name is Larry. Larry Laffer. Nice to meet you both, says Roberta. But how did you get in here? This is supposed to be a high security area. We just dropped in. Literally, offers Larry. Actually, Berta. Uh, we've had one hell of an adventure getting here. Why, I've been through a virtual maze of bamboo forest with just one drink of water. Rappelled down a sheer cliff on a pair of pantyhose, crossed an incredible chasm with only a handmade rope, fought ferocious feral swine with my underwear, ridden a log through a whitewater canyon, and... Okay, already. Enough, enough, laughs Roberta. But what about him? I... I... Larry stammers. I've had quite a few adventures in my day, too. Oh, really? replies Roberta. Anything that might make an adventure game? Uh, of course it would, Bert. You, you brag confidently. If you could just set us up with a little place to work, up to my reasonable standards, of course, we would write a whole series of adventure games for you. We could discuss this over lunch, Larry interrupts. I haven't eaten a thing this entire game. <laughs> nice. 
As the three of you head off together, Roberta says, We do have a home on the lake. Would that adequately meet your needs, Patty? Hmm. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Credits? And so it ends. <laughs> Larry and Patty move in together, sharing a simple programmer's shack in the mountains. Patty gives up her musician's life on the road for one man she found able to match her passion. Larry begins to tell the world his life story through software. Oh my god, look at this. Let's see now. It all began in Lost Wages. Oh. I mean, it is a good ending. Outside a bar named Louie's. No, Louie, Louie, uh, it's not right either. Hey, Patty. <laughs> uh, give me another beer, Patty. How about lefties? That's good, babe. Hmm, maybe I should compile and test this. Let's see if my little Larry can go inside. Oh, oh my god, he's, he's programming Leisure Suit Larry 1 in Leisure Suit Larry 3. I, oh god. G gotta, gotta save and compile it. <laughs> uh, this really is UL Quest right here. Alright, this is UL's quest right here. <laughs> the end. The end. Congratulations. You did it. You've won. We hope you've enjoyed Leisure Suit Larry 3, Passionate Patty in Pursuit of the Pulsating Pectorals. You, Larry, and Patty have certainly been through a lot together. You did a great job. But you did miss a little something. For instance... Okay, what did I miss? You shouldn't have shortchanged yourself while straddling that log. What? Uh, apparently I shortchanged myself on the log. You probably don't know it, but a lot of the points that you were missing above got lost when you didn't completely explore the island in your showgirl costume. Uh, hey, at least they tell you what you missed, right? That's awesome! Hmm. Alright, I feel like I did good. I guess that's the end. That's that's Leisure Suit Larry 3. <laughs> and uh, yeah, UL's still here, but like, come on, you can't tell me this ain't UL Quest right here. <laughs> Alright, look, you, you you get the girl and then you then you do some code, right? Get you get the get the girl, write your code. That's boom! UL Quest 3. <laughs> uh, Alright. I, man, so yeah, I, I don't know, Leisure Suit Larry, so here's the thing, I loved the first Leisure Suit Larry, I loved it because it was my first exposure to, to Leisure Suit Larry, and I was like, god damn, this is my jam, right, but the second one kind of lost me a little bit, I, it had a weird plot, but the third one got me back on board, I, I was back on board with this one, alright, I, I can't wait to play the fifth one now, because there is no fourth Leisure Suit Larry, so I, I can't wait to play the fifth one. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm intending on playing them all, even, even the, the crappy 3D one. I'm, I'm gonna play them all, alright? Eventually. Let's not, let's not rush it now, you know, we'll space it out. But, damn, I like Leisure Suit Larry, I do. Mm. And I like his theme song. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, the first time Leisure Suit Larry, uh, the first time Larry exposed himself to me. Oh my. Although I miss the the VGA version, the the zipper option. I feel like all the games need a zipper option. Mm. But anyway, that's that's all for Leisure Suit Larry for tonight. All right.